गुड इवनिंग टू वन एंड प्रेजेंट ओवर हेयर सो द टॉपिक फॉर टूडेज लेक्चर इट इज एनर्जी क्राइसिस सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग दिस टॉपिक आई वुड लाइक टू डिवाइज दिस टॉपिक इन टू थ्री पार्ट द फर्स्ट वन वुड बी द इंट्रोडक्शन देन वी वुड बी सींग द रीजन फॉर द एनर्जी क्राइसिस इन द ग्रुप एंड ऑल्सो द सुटेबल सॉल्यूशन दैट आर बींग प्रपोज बाय द एक्सपर्ट and in at the last we would also see that what is the stand of the india and how india is taking as its long term goal and how it is proceeding to begin with the introduction introduction that the energy crisis is basically the inability to reach the to meet the demand of the end users or the customer so uh, it just mean that there is a difference between the supply of the energy and the demand of the energy the supply of the energy is not is inadequate to meet the demand of the uh, people or demand of the population so uh, what are the problem uh, due to which this energy crisis is happening it is the major problem is the overpopulation with the rise of population uh, we could see that the standard of living of the people are also increasing and with the increase in the technology the more consumption of the energy is getting increased and uh, as we are seeing that uh, due to the alarming rise of population uh, the demand for this uh, for the energy is also increasing alarmingly and as we know that there are limited amount of uh, non renewable resources that we are using right now like petroleum diesel coal so and uh, in the coming future in the very short span of time in the few decades it is going to be exhausted and then what so this is the big question that arises to us we, we besides this we could also see the major reason for the energy crisis is the wastage of energy we could have we would have seen that many of them have a habit not to, uh, to uh, go for uh, go by a bike or car for even a short distance instead of walking and when they come out of the room they do not turn their uh, turn off their light or uh, the fan so this also created a lot this bits and pieces of energy on a on a larger scale contribute to a large amount of wastage of energy now when uh, we see that what it its alternative then uh, switching towards the non renewable source of energy is the alternative your new renewable source of energy could be wind energy tidal energy and also the solar energy but uh, is we could see that uh, the technologies that are used in order to harness this energy are quite expensive and also uh, it cost a high maintenance cost that's why it is right now not used at a large scale now as when i talk about india so india has been proactively participating in promoting the non renewable source of energy india has also targeted to produce 170 5 kg gigawatt of energy by uh, by non renewable source of energy besides this energy we know that india has got a larger coastline area which serves a good amount of uh, which provides a tremendous opportunity for india in order to extract the tidal energy and also the wind energy beside we also know that india is a tropical country and as it is situated near the equator most of the part of the year it has it faces a direct sun rays sun rays so india has also a vast opportunity in order to extract the solar energy although government of india has initiated a lot of initiative in order to promote the uh, promote to use the solar panel but is still there there are many more uh, many more uh, steps that needs to be taken and let us join hand together in order to deal with this energy crisis and promise that we won't be would be using the energy uh, to the optimum of our use and we would not be wasting any of the energy or any of the resources thank you mm-hmm.